Hello. Uh, as we know, we, we uh, create uh, our program develop uh, mobile application. We could uh, create layout and uh, uh, using uh, uh, activity main activity HTML. Where, uh, uh, this is the login uh, uh, activity or create uh, activity. Uh, uh, if you would like to see the uh, HTML of this. Uh, window we press and take it and this all the HTML code for the last uh, uh, layout each one or each each one of these buttons or tickets this is the code and this is the tag of each one okay yeah. go to the layout design it's easy okay now if we'd like to uh, try this and run it in the uh, uh, mobile smartphone mobile machine so we connect as using usb cable and the connection of the usb uh, from uh, into the laptop and the other end uh, layer plus uh, suitable end connector to the mobile smartphone like samsung or uh, any mobile which will uh, operate in android uh, uh, application uh, uh, another way is to test or run the program which we design now is to use our uh, uh, operate it through the accumulator so if we are in this plot uh, in, in, in the Android studio inside it we uh, pu pu put or press in this icon which is ABD manager ABD manager Android virtual uh, <coughs> device so we press so now we have uh, this uh, 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 virtual device which is uh, its name uh, uh, AVI uh, 29 and this is a resolution the degree of the AVI 29 and if we can also create another virtual device okay and another one so it will be 3 and 4 uh, so now we operate it we press here Oh, see, so this is a message of error. What the error here? It's not. It's not operating now. But give me us some a message. We have to read it. It says that Intel HAXM is required to run this Android virtual device. Lower AVD. This is VD VTX is disabled in BIOS. So enable we need to enable vtx in our BIOS security settings so how to do this simply we will shut down our laptop or computer desktop and then run it again and not go directly to the booting of the windows or uh, any uh, print system but we press f12 or f10 or f2 to enter the BIOS okay so it, it gives us a, a message enter bias or uh, go to booting we enter bias and inside bias we search and one attribute or one property which is uh, related to security or advanced and in the advanced or security in the bias according uh, to the system it's uh, uh, B, uh, HB uh, computer or Dell or uh, anyway so we will search our own a property which is called uh, uh, VTX and it change its uh, uh, status from disabled to enabled. We can uh, test the uh, uh, emulator from outside. Okay, from outside. So we we go. We have to close to close this project. Okay, and and uh, uh, enter and enter a. Uh, configure and here configure press AVD manager we will get the same the same the same window okay we will get the same one so because there is some problem we don't get this uh, here now we also need to use SDK manager SDK manager will be operated to add or create the SD key uh, apps or uh, tools or libraries SD key layer or uh, the uh, stands for uh, uh, <coughs> ah, yeah. 
So we we here we what what we need now, okay? We will set our SDK which needed to operating our uh, our uh, Android Studio to be uh, uh, appropriate, okay? And don't forget uh, we have also here not only SDK but we have ABI. So we have two things: SDK tools. SDK tools and the ABI uh, tools. Okay, so uh, SDK tools and ABI tools are very very important, as you know. Uh, so uh, for, for for our application to be uh, good, we have to set uh, uh, SDK Android Seven, Android Seven Nuga, yes Nuga. Uh, which is uh, uh, of EBI 25, okay? Uh, uh, is, it, is it only this one? I think we need another, another one, which is uh, 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 SDK 7, SDK 7, this is one. SDK uh, 25, which is 21, uh, yes. SDK, SDK Android 5, which is a, uh, which is 21 press and then a okay apply press apply okay huh? now it's going to a uh, download the ebk uh, sdk okay uh, so as you see sdk is related to abi okay It's uh, take time to download the SDK, SDK tool, which is is, uh, is uh, uh, for ABI twenty one and for ABI twenty Uh, ABI Lower Application Programming Interface. ABI Low, it uh, stands for Application Programming Interface. Thanks for listening. I will come back after downloading. Thanks.